Hey everybody, it's Kim, and I got in the mail some happy mail from my friend Joan. She said she was purging her Christmas stuff. Oh my gosh, Joan, you were awesome. So she sent me a little note, and then she made a card. Look at this cute little sticker. That's such a nice touch. And she makes the most gorgeous cards. Look at this. Isn't he adorable? I believe this is Stampin' Up. And there's that, I think that's from Tim Holtz. Oh. Thank you, Joan. I'm not going to read that out loud, but yeah, you, I appreciate you. Okay, so this is filled with awesomeness. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my god. I see the teal. What is this? Teal. Oh, there's to and from, but look at that. Oh my gosh. Teal, oh, we used to have, I remember this car because <laughs> I think it was a big old Oldsmobile and it. I got my fingers stuck in the, look at the van. Is that not adorable? Oh my gosh, thank you, Joan. Oh, and then a red car with the tree on top. These are adorable. I don't remember ever seeing these out and about, so that's cool. And some rosettes, because, you know, I love them. I have things to make them, but I never do. So I think these are, yep, Anna Griffin. Thank you. Gosh, are you sure? You guys are amazing. Ooh, more. Are they the same one? I think they're the same one. Rosettes. I am set for rosettes. <laughs> I'm rhyming. Oh, boy. I get a little giddy when it's the end of, I get a break. These are gorgeous. I absolutely love American Craft, and this is from Tuesday Morning. Thank you. Look at that plaid. Oh my gosh, Joan, you're spoiling me. I can't believe we're not keeping this stuff. I remember this guy. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Look at the gingerbread house and the Santa. So I get a couple of those and some presents. These are adorable. Me two of those, my goodness. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, Jolie's love the reindeer, those are adorable. And this is Tuesday morning. I uh, used up mine, so that's awesome. I think one is, yeah, one's smaller than the other one. White set is that are gold. Remember these and the red ones, gorgeous. Match my fingers. <gasps> Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. These are absolutely more tags. These tags got to be Tuesday morning again or Anna Griff. Maybe they're Anna. They, they scream Anna. Oh, my gosh. Look at these vintage. The bird. There's a couple of those and a few of those. My birds. <laughs> I was telling Margo I was talking to her on the phone this morning. Going, they're going crazy. They are going for the suet this year. I mean, they're at this time of year, I guess I should say. Look at this. Oh, I don't want to cover her head. That's sad. At first, I thought that was a roll of toilet paper. 2020. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Carry your own toilet paper. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's been a year, right, guys? Anyway, there's ornaments. So pretty. And then there are these gorgeous ornaments. Aren't those gorgeous? Should do a DIY with something like that. These are so four of the, Oh, and here this is, they're all the same. Four of those. That's awesome. Ooh. Martha Martha. Ooh. And it's got the gingy stuff. And I'm I'm really into those this year. I don't know why. We don't really uh, I used to bake cookies. I don't anymore. I will when Emma gets a little she withstands the you know, cooking for a few minutes and then she moves on to something else. She doesn't have a long attention span yet. She's still a wee one. But there we go. Ooh, I just love it. Look at that wood grain. Some of the deer. Are these not? And you could cut these out and use them for, you know, like a sticker. Oh, this is adorable. Look at the stockings. Ooh. It's all winding. Oh, I love this. I really love my birds. And then in the back, I got I feed my squirrels and the neighbor cat. <laughs> so we keep everybody happy in separate parts of the lot here. So I don't 
interact with each other in the wrong way. Look at these trees. Are those? Joan, thank you so much. Oh, wait. It's kind of the stickery part came out. Oh my gosh. These are adorable. That's my favorite one. Look at that cute plaid. Unbelievable. Look at, see, you could just cut those things out and use them on your page. A card. Or, I'm having a hot flash. What the heck? I tell ya. Okay, then I'm going to combine this with a few things that came in the mail. Not much. I turned some of you on to Judy's Cutting Dies on um, Facebook. She knows me as Kim. Not Some people say, well, I was sent by Kimbo Creations, and I don't know if she knows who that is, and that's fine. So a couple of you have said who you were sent by, and she does a great job, and I'm telling you, you get billed right away through PayPal, and I just thought these would be good for slimline cards. A long banner, and they have a stitching on them. That's cute. And then from an Etsy shop, which... I think I already, and I just got some from, who was I watching? Oh, she's a local gal, and she does tags every year. Oh, this one goes in the middle. Um, oh, I hate that when that happens. Anyway, she did some with little cookie cutters, some cards and tags with the gingies, so I had to have those, and these are Dress It Up, and... Oh, these were these I got in the mail. I ordered on Etsy and I've got some from Joan. And then I looked in my stash and darned if I didn't have. But I love this. It has all the baking, like the cookie sheet, the mitts, the cookie jar, and different gingies. This one is Button. Oh, I think that's the name of the shop, Buttons Glore. I'll list it below. And then I just thought these were adorable little lights, Christmas lights. Aren't those cute? And I got, these are tiny, but I just think they're so adorable. So there's a sled, let's see, a lot of glare there. Christmas tree, snowman, little eensy beensy tiny gingies, and a Rudolph. I bet you can't even see that, can you? No, Kim, we can't. <laughs> anyway. I haven't drank anything, I swear to God, except decaf coffee. It's been stuck in a house all day. You guys get it. So, my plan is to play. I um, will be seeing my other son, so I won't be here for part of the vacation. I'll be with my Tori, which is awesome. I can't wait. And But this week coming up, I have about five days here. Spend five day, four days with them, and then I'll come back again, so... And have a few days before break or break is over. So I'm hoping everybody has an awesome weekend. My next video will be of my Tonic Studio. It's supposed to arrive. I'm tracking it. It'll blink when I, you know, it'll alert me when I get it. Yeah, I don't have a shopping addiction at all. And I went and got some of my packages. Gail turned me on to Easy Prints Canvas. And so I ordered a bunch. I'll show it when I get them up of my granddaughters and me, them together, my family photos of the each little family, and you can get 11 by 16 for a really good price. And then I got some eight by eights to kind of mix them up and it's gonna be so cute. So I'm excited about that. So Easy Canvas Prints, it's a great site. Um, prices are really good. Shipping, you know, they get you somewhere, but I feel like it was, it comes quick. I really liked it. So anyway. I used, did some Christmas gifts with that too. I already gave Eric and Riley theirs because I couldn't wait. We did our Christmas a little early because I'm flying there, so I didn't want to have to, you know, ship things or whatever. So, anywho, enough about that. Um, but I just wanted to come on, say hi, and share Joan. You gotta stop spoiling me, people. You guys are awesome. I'm just like, oh my gosh. So I have enough stuff here to create for the next 50 years if I live that long. Where would I be? Okay. Oh, speaking of that. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, you can cut off. I'm done showing stuff. So if you don't want to hear this, but I've been like, I've told you, I've been on TikTok. I don't know if I shared this or not, but there was this question. This guy goes, is if 2020 wasn't weird enough, 
he says, in this year, if you add your birth year, so whatever, 19 blankety blank, plus your age, it equals 2020. Try it out. So I'm like, okay, I will. And I do, and it does. And I'm like texting my boys going, can you believe this? It's so creepy. And they're like, mom, <laughs> it's simple math. That would happen no matter what. Unless your birthday hasn't happened this, you know, this year. Like if you're in the late December. Anyway, because any year. So next year I'd take the next, you know, 1961 plus my new age, which is going to be 60. It would equal 2021, right? I'm just like, I'm so gullible sometimes, and I'm not math-oriented, but even my son that really isn't math, he's, Ryan's like, uh, Mom, that's just simple math. I was like, oh, sorry. But Margaret got fooled by it, too, so I feel, we all feel better now, because Eric said about five years ago he got tricked by it, too, so anyway try that out. See if you can get anybody to fall for that because I sure did. All right, guys. Take care. Talk to you soon. Bye.